Hello and welcome to Optics Trades YouTube channel. We're going to be making another short review today. We have here Delta Point Pro made by Leupold. Leupold is an American manufacturer of optics that was founded in 1907 and it is still family owned as it was in the beginning. They manufacture adult sights, rifle scopes, spotting sp scopes, binoculars and similar. And they manufacture their products for many organizations in America including the United States Army, Navy SEALs, Marine Corps and so on. Their products are also popular in the civilian market and especially among Americans but they're also gaining in popularity here in Europe even though there are, they are obviously not as common here as they are there. This is the product so uh, looks very nice. This uh, weighs 53.8 grams which equals 1.9 ounces uh, it is 46 millimeters long, that equals 1.8 inch, uh, 33 millimeters wide, 1.3 inch, and the same applies for height, so again 33 millimeters or 1.3 inch. Uh, it's an open reflex sight, very compact, very lightweight, uh, a little bit heavier than a traditional compact op open reflex red out sight of this type, but still in the lightweight zone. Um, this additional weight uh, adds to the uh, quality feel, if nothing else. So um, it is great for mounting on pistols, uh, on handguns, but can also be mounted on a rifle. There are plenty of mounting accessories available from Leupold. They're listed in this instruction manual and I'll get to that later on. There are two versions available, one with a 2.5 MOA dot, one with a 7.5 MOA dot. Um, so um, this one, the 2.5 MOA version comes with a standard dot, the 7.5 MOA version comes with a radical in the shape of a triangle. We have a nice big window that provides an unobstructed field of view. The size of window is, so we have 25.0 centimeters of width and 17.5 uh, millimeters of height. Um, there is a, as you can see, a metal cover around the hood which is great, so it additional protection for the fragile hood um, and this hood adds to the overall durability and reliability for this site, so it is really made to withstand harsh conditions. Um, Leupold uses the diamond coat scratch resistant spheric lens and uh, not only is that it is scratch resistant, it is also very good optically, so when looking through it you'll you'll see, if, especially if you take it and look um, um, somewhere um, towards the colors, so the forest or the, or the meadows, you'll see that the colors are really preserved and the image is very lifelike, so optically this site is really top-notch. We get unlimited eye relief and of course windage and elevation, elevation and windage adjustments, which are regulated with the help of these two adjustment screws. The adjustment range of both is 60 MOA, one click equals one MOA, meaning that it moves the point of impact for approximately one and a half centimeters on 100 meters. So I don't have any specific tools, that was no, no uh, tool for the manipulation is added, you can just use a screwdriver or something similar to rotate this. Um, both adjustments are of the clockwise, clockwise type, which is distinctive for American red dot sights and rifle scope rifle scopes. So what does this mean? It means that rotating the uh, elevation adjustment screw counterclockwise will move the point of impact up, whereas rotating the windage adjustment screw counterclockwise will move the point of impact to the right. There are some really innovative solutions used with this red out sight. For example, the battery compartment is opened with the help of this notch you just put back and the battery cap jumps right up. Then you can just attach this battery here because there is a magnet inside and you just simply put it back. So very innovative, uh, very unique um, and Leupold really have outdone themselves uh, in this segment. Uh, it uses a classic CR2032 battery that can be bought pretty much everywhere, easy to find. The, the, the mount comes, uh, the mount, the sight comes without the mount um, there are plenty of mounting accessories available in default. They're listed right here. So um, we have the single base and dovetail bases available for the firing, 
firearms and we also have some additional accessories. We have the Picatinny mounting plate, which I also have here. So this here is the mounting plate so that you can mount this Leupold Red Dot sight on a Picatinny platform. Um, yeah, so moving on. It is waterproof to 10 meters, which equals 33 feet. And the operating temperature is from minus 92 degrees, uh, minus uh, 29 degrees to plus 50 degrees. And Leupold states that it can even be stored in temperatures as extreme as minus 40 degrees Celsius. So really nice. Moving on to the optical characteristics and the illumination. We have the one times magnification so that you can look through with both eyes open. You can now also see the dot, the definition of the dot, which is very nice. Um, well, um, it would be even better if it was in focus now on the camera, but at least you can uh, still see the, the, the size and everything. Then we have the eight illumination intensity levels to choose from. Uh, you, this is the power button here. You have to press it to turn it on, of course, and then you cycle through individual levels by repeatedly pressing this button. And um, yeah, the definition is nice, I already mentioned this, but you have to move the finger away from here once you set the illumination so that you can see uh, the, the, the intensity level of the dot. Because if you leave the finger here, you're actually blocking the beam of light that is, um, that is then not reflected from the objective lens because it, um, your finger is in the way, so you have to move it away which is something that could be done a little bit better. Now, uh, when the highest or lowest setting is reached, the, the, la the LED will flash five times, and then you, to change the direction of uh, adjustment, meaning that to cycle through the levels of intensity the other way around, you have to press and hold the power button for two seconds. And then you, if you went up, you'll go down. Uh, to power it off, hold the button for around 3 seconds and when you turn it back on, the side will go to the setting that you set before turning off the device. A nice addition uh, once again. It also has a low battery detector. Uh, when the battery life is low, the aiming point will flash 10 times. And when this appears for the first time, there are still several hours of operating time. So a nice way to know uh, when to uh, take an extra battery with you on the field. Um, illumination is suitable both for daytime brightness and twilight. Uh, it has a power saving mode as well, so when the optic is stationary for 4 or 5 minutes, uh, the unit will go into sleep mode, preserving battery life, and when it detects movement, the optic will power back on to the latest set illumination intensity level. Um, yeah, so as regards the scope of delivery, we have two hexagonal tools. One is used to uh, mount the device on a mounting plate with the help of these two screws. The other one is used for, uh, I don't know, if you want to remove the metal hood or if you want to unscrew these two screws that hold the, uh, this, uh, my, I would say, the uh, rear iron sight. Uh, this is actually a plate that can be removed and then an accessory with a rear iron sight can be placed on. So this is what this tool is used for. Then we have the rubber uh, cover to protect the side when you're not using it. The instruction manual where all the, all the mounting accessories are. Also some instructions on how to mount the uh, device on several uh, platforms and so on. So you also get, of course, the screws for mounting and the Leupold's lifetime warranty. Now, um, before before uh, ending this review, we have to, of course, now sum up some of the advantages and disadvantages. The advantages are the optics. So optically, this is very good. You can now see the dot again. And there is no tint. Now, when you, if you remove one and look to the white background, there is no tint whatsoever. Then the build quality, is, which is also really nice. We have the metal hood for protection. This is a compact light red dot sight, which is a little bit heavier than other sights of the same type, but still in the lightweight zone. 
Um, then we have innovative solutions like the opening of the battery cap, the magnetic, the magnet here that you can simply put the battery down, put it back again. Really easy, really simple, can be done in seconds. Um, then the option of putting on a, a rear iron sight which can be bought at Lupol and so on. So really innovative in all aspects. The disadvantages, the first one is of course the price. This is one of the most expensive red dot sights of the open reflex type currently on the market. It, it's, it's priced around 600 euros here in Europe. Also you have to keep in mind that a specific mounting plate has to be ordered which adds to the final price. Then of course the, the way that you manipulate with the illumination. So it's really innovative but you actually, <clears throat> when you want to change the illumination level you have to put the finger in between the diode and the lens uh, and you will not see the dot un unless you move the finger away. Um, and another thing, it is really a pity that there is not the universal uh, Noblex, so the X-Doctor mounting platform beneath which would make the mounting procedure really easy because a lot of mount, uh, mount manufacturers out there make uh, mounting solutions for this platform. So this, to sum up, this is a dot that that costs quite a lot, but for this price you get amazing optics, you get amazing build quality. So this is amazing in all aspects, you get innovative solutions um, and you definitely won't regret buying this Red Dot site. Thank you guys for watching, if you found it useful, like, subscribe, check out our other videos and also leave a comment in the comment section, we'll try to reply as soon as possible or send us an email. And see you in the next review and bye-bye.